Hello everyone and welcome back to Mommy Talk. I'm just gonna apologize for the lighting really fast. Um, it's kind of dark in here. I'm just in the middle of my kitchen and it's like 9 o'clock at night. So obviously I have really hard lighting and there's not a ton of it in here. But I'm just gonna attempt to do a grocery haul today because I went grocery shopping and I didn't get a ton, a ton of stuff. But this is probably gonna last us like about two weeks. This is about two weeks worth of groceries. Maybe, if that, um, for a family of six. A lot of it is mostly like lunch stuff for the boys and um, just stuff that we needed, I guess, because we were really running out of a lot of stuff and we needed to go grocery shopping. So, um, like I said, it's not like a ton of stuff. There's still a lot of stuff that I actually forgot, but because I took all four of the kids shopping, it was really hard to stay focused when they're like running around crazy and making sure they weren't running into other people and tearing things off the shelves. So, this is what we got on our grocery shopping trip Do you know today. where Daddy is? He's sitting on the couch. I guess I'm just gonna go through each bag and then show you what I got. Is that how people typically do grocery hauls? All right, so let's just start with this bag. So, we've got three boxes of this pasta roni stuff. It takes at least and I have another bag full, full of more of these. Um, it takes at least three boxes of these to like have enough for our family, like portion wise. It takes at least three boxes. We usually use this as like a side for dinner, and it takes three of these boxes. So um, I actually have a bag. There, there's more in a bag somewhere else, but um, I bought three of these because they're super cheap. But we really like it. It's like super quick to make, and I don't know. I think it tastes good. So <laughs> yeah. So we got three. Pastaroni, fettuccine alfredo things. I've got a couple boxes of this yellow rice. This is again, I, I like to use this as like a side dish for dinner. It's like a New Orleans uh, yellow rice kind of flavored rice. It's just like regular rice, but flavored. Okay, I'm gonna move on. Um, Pop tarts for the kids. Sometimes when we're uh, when I'm getting the kids ready for school, I run out of time. <laughs> Typically, I run out of time for breakfast and I don't always have time to get them like an actual breakfast. So I bought these just in case we were running late and they just needed something quick to eat on our way to school. Um, spaghetti, a five pound bag of spaghetti because we go through a lot of spaghetti noodles as you could probably tell we're like a family of six so we go through a lot of food so I bought a five pound bag which that will probably only last us like, I don't know. I mean. It, Depending on how often we have spaghetti, that'll probably last us like th three, maybe three meals. Two, maybe three. Two, possibly three meals. Alright, in this bag we have some bagels, just your plain ordinary bagels. We have two things of ready-made prepared pasta sauce, because this is just something that's like, I like to pick these up because they can be really quick in a pinch, you know, you just basically have to warm it up and cook the spaghetti noodles in a pinch if you need like a quick meal. And then we got some oranges. In this bag we have a big bag of tricks because we go through cereal super fast in this house. And then we have a big box of diced peaches. I only like the Dole brand of this. I've tried off-brand and store brand of like the fruit cups and stuff, but when it comes to peaches, I only like Dole. For some reason, I don't like the other. Like they're too squishy or something. But anyway, I mainly bought these for like the boys' lunches or just like lunchtime in general, because they're really easy um, for the kids to eat. And then I bought a thing of instant oatmeal because normally we just have cereal in the morning but sometimes it's nice to just have something else that you can make quick um, but to kind of like stir <laughs> like kind of mix it up a little bit so that you're not just having cereal every morning and then I also bought these for me because these are like my guilty pleasure snack I love pumpkin seeds I don't buy them all the time but they just happen to be like right there when I was picking stuff up so I just bought like a bag really fast so I can stack on these. And then I got family size, value size bugles, because I love bugles. And it would be nice um, to 
to have like for lunches and stuff. When I'm home with Lyric and Zuko, box of Cinnamon Life. I got this because I had a coupon for one free box of cereal and I just, I don't know, I bought this. <laughs> so, Cinnamon Life. And then we have three things of bread that I bought. Three loaves of bread because we go through bread super duper fast in this house. So we got three. They were on sale. Three for five dollars. So I went ahead and picked that up. And then in this bag over here, we have another box of instant oatmeal, except in the apple cinnamon flavor. And then, um, oh, actually, that's non-food stuff. I'll get to that in a second. And then behind me, oh, I have this giant thing of applesauce because this was like on sale and there's 36 cups in here. So that will make it really nice for like lunches, like I said, for the boys, for packed lunches and stuff. Or even just for like Lyric and Zuko for their lunch here. We will go through that in like no time. It's super heavy and stuff, but. Um, and then I got uh, this, I also got for lunches, for packed lunches. Um, there is 40 juice boxes in here. And this is just for packed lunches. I figured that it would be nice to have like juice boxes to go in the kids' lunch sometimes. They are offered water at school, obviously, but I thought it would be nice to let them, to offer them like juice every once in a while. Then behind me, we have a giant thing of Danimals because my kids love yogurt and they love the drinkable yogurt. And so I got this for um, the kids a big pack of animals which they will go through in this will probably last only like maybe a couple weeks and then a five pack of mac and cheese because it's nice to just whip have this as a staple to whip up as like a side or something for dinner if we're like running late on something or whatever and then more boxes of the fettuccine and then I have ranch and Italian dressing, and these aren't actually going to be used for sale. This is going to be used for a marinade for chicken, and this is going to be used probably for like vegetable dip. I like to send the kids with like fresh veggies and like a thing of ranch to dip it in. And then some French toast bagels because they were having a sale for the other bagels. It was like buy one get one free, so I got one plain one and one in the French toast flavor because I thought that would be fun taste good. And then for some non food, oh, and then I also got a big bag of lunch bag chips for the boys for their packed lunches so they could have some chips for lunch. Okay, and then I also bought some non-food stuff. Um, not a ton of stuff, but just like I just picked up a couple things that I needed. So for the kids' lunch, I picked up, these were like on sale and they're like little sandwich tins. And um, I have like a couple other containers that we bought when we went back to school shopping for the boys, but nothing that was like just a plain sandwich container. I picked these up because I was like really tired of like using plastic bags and I felt really bad that we were like wasting pla like so much plastic. So I picked these up because they were like super cheap and on sale and um, they're just like little sandwich tins boys' packed lunch. And then I picked up some more of these. We have a few already that we bought like at the same time when we went back to school shopping, but they keep disappearing. <laughs> I don't know where they're going. I don't know if the kids are accidentally throwing them away or what, but this was also like in the same place. It was like super cheap and on sale. So it's just like these little mini containers that I can put like ranch in or like, I don't know, just different things. Like if I have like pudding or something that I just make in a batch, I can put in there, you know, just whatever, for lunch. And then I got some shampoo and conditioner, because if you saw my vlog today of before I went shopping, I was complaining about my hair and how damaged it is. So hopefully, I don't know, I'm gonna try out this Tresme brand. I don't know, I don't really know anything about hair products, so I'm gonna try it. And then I also needed a refill on face powder and mascara. That's my mascara that I use. Isn't it pretty? That's my mascara that I use. So, and then I also got a thing of flushable wipes, just because it's like really nice to have around. That's kind of embarrassing to say, but 
Sometimes toilet paper just doesn't cut it. <laughs> Regular baby wipes because we ran out of those. So we got baby wipes as well. And then I also got some stuff that I already put away in the fridge and the freezer. I got some like chicken, a roast, a um, couple things of hot dogs, and um, some hamburger. A lot, I got quite a bit of hamburger. But I already put that stuff away in the fridge and I'm not gonna get it out again because you don't need to see it. But anyway, so that is my grocery haul for today. I'm sorry if I was like super monotone, my voice, I'm losing my voice, it's starting to crack because I just like, I'm super sick right now. But I just wanted to show off what I bought today and now I've got to take care of this mess. So anyway, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to follow me on Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter and subscribe if you aren't already. Hit that like button if you are subscribed and I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye guys! <laughs>